long time no see. Actually, I haven't been doing videos, but it hasn't been a vlog type follow me around video in a very, very long time. I'm here in my apartment. <laughs> But I have news, you guys. As you can probably read by the title, I'm moving. I cannot believe it's been a whole year since I moved into this apartment. And it's just so sad that I'm leaving. But, like, the place I'm moving to, much better. Not apartment living anymore. <laughs> so, anyway, I am actually here for about two or three hours today. And I'm going to be packing up some stuff. I do have Everest here. Oh, she's here. Everest. Look at her. <laughs> hey. So I actually did film a couple videos, a couple puppy update videos. Probably by the time this goes up, they would have gone been posted, but I'm not really sure. I still have to edit them and all that fun stuff. So you can see that I have already started the process of moving. A lot of stuff is like down and well, I, not a lot of it. Like I have a good bit left, but it's okay. Just just little bits at a time and it's gonna be nice. That's that's the beauty of not moving from Pennsylvania to South Carolina where I had to take everything in one haul. And now I can just do little bits at a time and it's nice. Um, what else? There's some things that have been going on. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up the camera and, and somewhere where I'm gonna start packing up and then we'll talk a little bit more. All right, now that looks good. <laughs> So I'm gonna be packing up some kitchen stuff. I have gotten a lot of the food. Uh, so I think I have, I just have a lot of dishes and stuff to take at this point and everything's falling. It's fine. <laughs> so guys, hi, how are you? Um, one thing that I thought of that I should mention before we just get real into this. Uh, well, before that, I don't know if this is all gonna, this is probably not gonna be just a, a solid, uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? Designated uh, moving vlog like the last one because I still have about a month and a half till I need to be out. So it'll kind of just be over time. I'm kind of trying to get a little bit more into vlogging again because I do love it. Uh, and plus, it's great to document the little pussy friends. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Look at this sweetie. Look at this sweetie. Hi. Mm -hmm. ah, okay, I gotta pack. Go close. Anywho, I always feel so scattered when I make these videos. Now, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I have another, well, there is another project in the works, you guys. So of course we know O'Clock Toys kind of isn't doing too great because of the whole COPPA thing and whatnot. I don't think I'm gonna take those yet. Um, the whole copy thing and whatnot, and it was just, it's just not a good time for making a living. So I'm trying to, as of right now, my goal is to, you know, really work hard with, um, wow, I'm blanking, with the gaming channel, and I want to do more with this channel, obviously, and then, surprise! I have another channel in the works, it's actually a, uh, a uh, uh, not only my channel, it's half my channel. It's called Carolina Wild Harvest. We have some videos coming soon, I haven't filmed them, but it's in the works, it is, I swear. I will make it happen, it will get done. <laughs> so feel free to go check that channel out, because I know a lot of you guys actually follow me specifically for like an animal and like my plant stuff and all of that fun jazz so i'm gonna have a designated channel for that which is really exciting because it's one of my favorite things to do and i can't wait for spring it's approaching so quickly i'm just not used to it because of living in pennsylvania so you know it's a change it's great I have much more nice weather. I honestly, in review of like this past year, I can't believe it's been a year. I wonder, was that the last vlog I did? I couldn't have been the last vlog, maybe it was. Um, but in a review, um, I have to say that I would never in a million years go back <laughs> to Pennsylvania after experiencing South Carolina. It's just so, it's so beautiful, you guys. It's really great here, it really is. Um, and the weather, so fantastic. I am, it's, it's, what is it, January? January, and I'm in this. I mean, 
I did wear a winter coat here, but like I don't need it. Like normally if I were inside the house, I would be bundled up with a hat and gloves and all the works, but not today and I'm really excited about that. <laughs> that. Anyway, I'm trying to just like strategically pack this and make it not completely heavy, which it already is. So. Anyway. So. <laughs> trying to think of like all the stuff. There's been just so much stuff that has happened. Um, uh, right now, hi, Everest just turned five months, you guys, just turned five months. I adopted her when she was one, almost two months, almost two, but she wasn't quite yet. And he's just, he's just grown so fast, you know? <laughs> okay, so what else do I need to say? Oh, M and Lucy are moved. They are moved. I felt really, really bad about them being here i mean i i will say i spent probably not a good amount of time with them um i definitely should have been here a little bit more but i was just at the the play the 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 the, 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 the new place um but you know now they're moved over there and now i can see them anytime i want and it's so great i love it seriously I love my animals like it was just so sad we moved to Lucy first and I mean I knew M would be fine M, M's, M is M you know she's she's super chill she is pretty resilient um, and I didn't think that it would affect her like being here without Lucy so obviously me and Lucy and so I moved her um, and then I just felt so bad I wasn't planning on moving M right away because my boyfriend has a cat and his cats she, she's super sweet she is she's super sweet but you know with my whole sahara situation you guys know uh i'm very paranoid about another cat in the household so i was kind of like waiting plus he has a dog and all of this fun stuff so i wasn't planning on moving em right away but i couldn't stand being without my little my little princess so obviously she moved in i think two days Two days or a day after Lucy moved, um, and it was—it's nice. It's great. Uh, she's doing well. Um, obviously, Lucy, she she can move anywhere. She won't be affected. Um, Emma, she seems to be doing just fine. Like just fine. She, I have her in my room. Um, it's it's like her Lucy's cage, and then her stuff and Everest stuff so basically my room is my pet's room and she just she stays in there and I have that white gate with the little pet door in it and I use that to separate her from the animals and her and uh the other cat Ava her and Ava all have been just staring at each other and it's good it's good everything just seems okay it M is very comfortable from what I can tell she's very comfortable in that room at least and I can tell she wants to venture out because you know in the morning she'll try to come out and then sometimes she comes in the bathroom with me because we kind of have it blocked off <laughs> kind of it's complicated but it's 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 great it's going better than I expected so far even though they haven't the animals really haven't had contact uh M and his dog have and they seem to be doing really well anyway that's like a whole thing <laughs> and I'm, I'm just glad that it's going okay you know it's just it's just going great <sighs> but packing though i think i what i did was well, my <laughs> my truck it's like a nice uh no i think no last time i had truck problems was a year ago when i moved here like real big truck problems so the truck i just picked it up from the garage and they had to replace the fuel pump to like do the whole fuel assembly thing because apparently i don't know there was a crack in the pipe or the hose whatever but it was so rusted they couldn't even like that's where it started cracking and they couldn't get they couldn't get it off and it was just like a whole thing it cost me a lot more than i thought it would and i'm very like especially with like kind of minimal income right now uh but we're gonna work it out we're gonna figure it out because you know that's that's how we roll around here i feel like this is gonna be too heavy let me let me check no that's not so what else i mean em's doing great lucy's doing great um I'm trying to think who else there is or what else there is 
I oh guess what you guys my chickens are becoming to live with me oh my gosh I'm so excited no it's like a it's it's a most likely um so we need to kind of set up a coop and a run and kind of just like re we have a big like garden and landscaping list and <laughs> It's just, it's on that list and we're going to do it. I think we wanted to do it by like somewhere in the springtime. I'm not really sure what the exact plan is, but I'm really excited. If they do come live with me, I'm going to make videos and I can do the chicken coop live streams again. You guys like, you guys really like the chicken live streams. So bring them back. Um, I just, oh, we did, lo we did lose Kanish. Uh, I feel like that might be the only chicken we lost since I last vlogged we don't really know what happened uh, my dad thinks it was the neighbor's dog obviously I wasn't there it was very upsetting I mean you know he was an extra rooster so I mean now there's one less pen occupied but at the same time he was my buddy you know and like him and Ophelia came to live with us together I rescued them from some guy that just you know left the chickens you know and it was just sad Anyway, anyway, um, I think that might be it for the animal updates. I think I'm going to go ahead and pack up some more and I'll show you guys my pile because I do have to get moving. I do want to stop by <laughs> Smoothie King. It's my favorite place right now. It's so expensive, but it's so delicious. And I do want to stop there and get myself a smoothie because I didn't bring fruit today. I forgot, completely forgot about it. I was going to. And oh, that reminds me, I might pack up my blender. So, uh, blah, 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 smoothie king. And then I have a pet sitting job for about a half an hour at 11.30. It's currently 9.18. And I am so excited. I'm just like, I'm not excited. I'll be real with you guys. Did, you, did I tell you guys I started a pet? I have a pet sitting business now. Anyway, if you guys follow me on Instagram, which is at zero H L U C K, because Oak Luck was taken, you'll know that I have a business. Anyway, so I'll be real with you guys. The, the, this client is not exactly my favorite client, just because um, I, I like them because they're they're an every week job. However. Their dog barks at me the whole time, just just barks. And it's not like a big dog bark, which is fine. It's that small little yippy dog bark. And no matter what I do, I can't get her to be quiet. Now, that's a lie because if I do, if I have like treats or something, yeah, oh, little baby's crying. If I have treats or something, she'll be quiet. It'll be fine. However, it's a half an hour visit and I don't want to overfeed this dog, but if it's what I have to do, you know, it's what I have to do, I mean. Because it's just like, it gets to the point where if, if it goes like more than 10 seconds without a treat in its mouth, it just starts barking again. No matter what. It's so loud. Like, it's just so high-pitched and loud. It's, mm hmm So I have that side of business going on. I have a lot of projects. And that's why I kind of started wanting to vlog and stuff. I think it's fun. Anyway, like I said, I have to go pack some stuff. And then I will check back in with you guys in a bit. When I last left you guys, I was actually at my apartment. I ended up being rushed for time and I ran out of time. I was running up and down the stairs trying to get everything packed before I had to be somewhere. So I'm actually at the new place now and I have my equipment kind of set up. This is actually like almost a week later, almost, no, like a half a week later. We actually made several trips, I think couple trips um, to get some more stuff through the bigger stuff so my table my filming stuff I got my toy stuff over here I'm really excited I'll be able to get back into filming I'm, I'm so beyond excited to actually start filming again um, specifically games I mean toys too but I'm still a little down and out and sad about it but I'm really excited um, I just wanted to update you guys and I did want to show you some videos uh, video clips of Everest Parker and Hurley playing so Hurley is my boyfriend's dog and Parker is my boyfriend's parents dog and we're dog sitting her so they have been playing like crazy in the backyard it's really cute so you guys have to see this
You want to play? Hurley, drop. Sit. 
Everest. Oh. M is here. Uh, it's actually been a little bit. Hold on, I'm trying to put her down. Ah, okay, she got stuck on my headphones. Anyway, I uh, I started this vlog like two weeks ago, or at the beginning of January. What I want to do is I want to do week long vlogs like I used to. Uh, not necessarily every week, but when I do a vlog, I want it to be a week. So I am going to kind of wrap up this vlog here today. I know. It's kind of been a little everywhere and you don't know what's going on, but uh, yesterday I posted the official announcement on Oak Luck. You guys probably saw it if you're seeing this video. I posted it probably right before this video, if not two videos ago. Uh, and it was for Carolina Wild Harvest, the new YouTube channel that I talked about a little bit in the beginning of this vlog, I think, unless I didn't and I lost the footage, but I think I talked about it a little bit when I was packing up my apartment. Uh, so that has officially been announced and released and first video is up second video should be going up soon i'm working on it <laughs> i'm kind of i've been motivated this past week maybe like these past couple days so i'm really working hard on toy videos on carolyn wild harvest videos on these videos for this channel as well as game videos i really want to start working on after i end this video i'm going to jump into that but I did uh, film a little bit for the toy channel today. I just ended up cleaning it up a little bit. My new favorite toys, the new Shopkins, not that you guys really care, but um, they are like little freezer foods. So they have all, a lot of different ice creams. They have um, like Eggo stuff, like uh, frozen meals. There's actually like Morningstar stuff too, the vegan stuff. So I'd really like to get some of those, that'd be fun. But uh, that's just for the toy channel. That's what's going on over there. We hung up my plaque, which is so exciting. So this is my official office space, yay. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. But anyway, we ended up actually 
there's a lot that's been going on. There's a greenhouse now outside. It's disassembled. There's going to be a video on that dedicated on Carolina Wild Harvest. That's something that's going to be happening here if you are subscribed over there. And here you'll see kind of sort of overlapping a little bit. I'll just talk about some of this stuff over there and maybe sometimes show like when we're doing the greenhouse. I might vlog a little bit. I don't know. It depends. It depends on if I'm doing a vlog that week or not because I do want to keep these condensed into a week. And I think it's been like three weeks, four weeks since I started this vlog. And I'm like, no, nah, this is isn't gonna fly now I have so many video clips I need to put together uh, it's crazy but what else is happening oh we need to seed start soon for you know our garden this year and I I'll show you some of the seeds that we have laid out uh, you can see the full garden plan coming soon on Carolina Wild Harvest's YouTube channel so I believe this is the pile of things we need to start like right now um, there's a lot of greens and stuff and we have some tomatoes over here. I'm really excited. I actually did bring out the trays. I do, do need to clean those. Uh oh, we sprung the leak. I have to clean that up. I don't know which seeds. That, that, I'll have to find the packet for that. But uh, we have a ton of stuff. We have, uh, I have little trays to clean from last year. I should have probably cleaned them last year, but, or two years ago actually, because I've lived here in an, I lived in an apartment for a year. So it, like obviously I didn't garden then. I mean I did a little backyard gardening or balcony gardening and I did cherry tomatoes. I do know that but that's about all. I had a peach tree and stuff. You guys know. I think you know <laughs> from some of my vlogs. Um, but there's a lot of greens in this pile. There's a lot of stuff but this is stuff that we need to start. And there is Hurley barking outside. There must be some packages being delivered. So yeah that's what's kind of going on uh, with that. I'm still in the process of moving. I need to be out of the apartment. Completely moved out of the apartment. Keys turned in by the end of February. Uh, it's going. You know, I have moved a majority of my stuff here. And I am living here primarily. Lucy's living here. Em is living here. Yeah, obviously, Everest is living here. <laughs> and it's been great. Everybody seems to be adjusting quite well. Em is... You know, it's still kind of unsure about Ava, and Ava's unsure of M. Ava is Ben's cat. And that's just kind of like the biggest issue, I guess, but it's not really an issue. Like, we, we've had them kind of together. There's just like a fenced off area. Like, M has one half of the house, Ava has the other kind of thing. It's, it's, it's working, it's fine for now. We'll see how it goes. Uh, so that's going good. I do go back to the apartment at least once a week to grab some stuff and I do need to go back this week. So I might start another vlog then because I do want to show you guys more of the apartment and how empty it is, all that stuff. Um, but I do have a majority of the, like any of the stuff I use day to day anyway here and big stuff and like furniture and stuff's left over there. I do need to grab some things for here though, like some tables and some tools and whatnot. But Anyway, I am going to end this episode here. Hopefully I'll get a little bit more into this as we go along. It was my first time really vlogging a week-long vlog kind of thing, which turned into a four-week vlog, <laughs> three-week vlog. But um, uh, hopefully I'll get back into it. Like I said, it's not going to be every week. Uh, you're still going to see the vegan hauls and the maybe the cooking uh, animal videos, all that stuff coming soon. I actually just filmed a vegan food haul video. So that should be coming up. I know it's probably going to be before this one, I would think. Maybe, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe it'll be after this one. I don't know, but it's coming soon or it has already come out. <laughs> So I'm actively working on everything and I'm excited to put a lot of effort into all these channels going forward. But anyway, if you guys haven't checked out Carolina Wild Harvest, make sure you go do so. I will be linking it down below. It is linked on my main channel page as well and every other one of my channel pages also. Go follow the Instagram. Uh, you can find me following it. I'm 0HCLUCK on Instagram. But you can also find Carolina Wild Harvests. It's just that with the S on the end. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.